Well, the NASA socials, man, I love talking about those because I love NASA. I mean, JPL, Jet Propulsion <laughs> Laboratory. Uh, ever since I saw Apollo 13 when I was like a little kid, I was just like, ah, I got it. Um, <laughs> and they've had these things called tweet ups since for, for years, dec- or maybe even a decade or more. The tweet ups eventually became the NASA socials because there was more than Twitter. All you got to do is sign up. You know, show them your social media credentials and you either get selected or you don't. And those, I can't stress enough those NASA socials, man. You have to get out there. If you're even remotely interested in, in science communication or uh, just engineering in general. I and mean, I've been to four uh, tours, um, a tour of NASA Sophia, which is a 747 jet with a telescope in the back. Went to California and I got to walk on board the aircraft and touch things I should have never been able to touch. Uh, we got to walk around, we got to uh, you know look at their other planes and it was an amazing experience. I did that whole video on my channel. There was Artemis Day where they released the, the new Artemis rocket. Hey, here's the here's the core stage of the Artemis rocket. And, uh, the, the last two that I've been to uh, was uh, the Starliner launch where Boeing creates this new capsule that they're going to start launching astronauts back into space with from American soil. Uh, that's the Starliner launch. That video is um, up on my YouTube uh, and TikTok. Uh, and then the uh, the SpaceX mission, which was the most recent mission, actually the last, I think, rocket that launched off American soil because of all this mess uh, was CRS-20, uh, the commercial resupply. Uh, for SpaceX, uh, it was their 20th mission and the last of their uh, their contract uh, with NASA. So it's pretty special. And if you go watch my CRS-20 launch video, that is the most beautiful rocket launch I've ever seen. Period. Uh, whether it be on just on video or in person. Uh, in person, it was unbelievable. Like I was. I was oh my awesome. god! Oh my god! <laughs> Oh my God. You know, I gotta rein that sort of enthusiasm in sometimes when I'm on video because it's there forever. And I'm like, oh, I'm tired of hearing myself going, whoa, you know, but you know, we had toured every building at Kennedy Space Center, you know, the day before. And so we were all hyped and everybody was hyped. And, you know, there were people there that knew what parts of launch were coming next and calling it out. So you can hear like my buddy Xander on the video. He's like, okay, here comes Miko, which is amazing. She's launching. And, uh, oh, 